the COVID-19 pandemic unleashed a once in a century disruption on every level of human life. And in few places was that disruption felt more than at school. In Chicago and across the nation, schools were forced to close their doors entirely to students. Seemingly overnight, the sounds of school bells, children running through halls, and classrooms buzzing with learning were replaced with the silence of an empty building. Once busy lunchrooms sat unused while families assembled to pick up meals outside. Playgrounds and athletic fields were blocked off and warning signs were posted to keep people away for their own safety. During a period where many were able to shelter in place at home, you, our principals, were still showing up in person every day. You worked around the clock to distribute hundreds of devices to families, help them set up internet access, and create and implement a previously non-existent remote learning infrastructure. You also led your staff and families through the uncharted waters of converting lesson plans and taking classes entirely online while trying to help students make sense of a summer of protests and racial unrest. There were mass mandates, contact tracing, and mandatory health screeners to enter buildings. There were care rooms and quarantines, along with rules and processes that changed faster than they could be posted. You were on the front lines, managing teacher frustrations, work stoppages, parent concerns, and student disengagement. And you juggled all these challenges while subbing in classrooms that were understaffed and trying to connect with students who had been away from school for more than a year. This is not the type of work you expected to be doing when you decided to become educators. We recognize that the stress you have experienced over the last two years was nearly unbearable, but through it all, you worked together to support each other and to find creative solutions to unimaginable problems. We want you to know we see your struggles, we hear your frustrations, we feel your pain and we are committed to prioritizing and enhancing the support we provide to alleviate these challenges because you are loved and highly valued. We also wanna say thank you. Thank you for your tireless dedication to your students, parents, teachers, and staff. Thank you for focusing on the well-being of the communities you serve and protecting your schools through the most challenging of times. Thank you for your sacrifices, dedication, and the spirit you give that keeps CPS moving in a positive direction, no matter what we face. We have come a long way since the beginning of the pandemic, and we have a long way to go. But CPS is and will continue to be a district on the rise. Our mission has not changed. We are still here to provide a high quality public education to every child in every neighborhood in Chicago that prepares them for success in college, career, and life. We are still educators and we still understand the needs of our students. So we are going to get back to focusing on our instructional core as the foundation of our future success. Today is about taking an honest look at what's working and what we can do better. By sharing ideas and insights, we can make changes that will lead to better outcomes for our students. Make no mistake, we are ready to get back to work less encumbered by the challenges of the last two years and more focused on the victories we can win for the future. And with all of you, our extraordinary school leaders at the helm, we know we will get there. So let's get excited for what's to come and let's continue to look out for and support each other. Because when we succeed, CPS and the city of Chicago succeed.